Trees are some of the biggest organisms on the planet. But where do they get that matter to grow? It's nutrients out of the ground. Just out of the soil, really, yeah. Goodness out of the soil, I suppose. It comes out of the soil? Yeah. Yeah. Goodness. Goodness. Mm. Why isn't there a big hole around the tree where it's taken out all the soil? Because it does it say gradually that the soil has time to recover. <laughs> <laughs> now, I think it's intuitive to believe that the tree gets most of its mass from the soil because you can see those roots digging into the soil and they must be taking something out of there. And I mean, a tree looks like dirt and it feels solid like dirt, but it's not. In the early 1600s, a scientist named Johann Baptiste van Hemholt tried to figure out where the mass of a tree was coming from. So he got a pot of soil and very carefully measured the amount of soil in there. Then he planted the tree and took care of it for five years making sure that no soil left or was added to his pot. And at the end of this experiment, he weighed the tree to find that it was 72 kilograms, but the mass of soil had only decreased by about 60 grams. This was pretty strong evidence that the mass of the tree does not come from the soil. I've never thought about that, actually, because they don't really eat anything, trees. They, they don't eat anything? No, no. They don't eat anything? Water is all they absorb. That's all they eat? Yeah. They don't eat anything else? No. That's all they eat? Well, presumably from the water and the nutrients from the soil. Is there anything else that you need besides the soil and the water? I suppose that's what you need, isn't it? To make uh, other, other than the original seed for, for that particular tree, I The suppose. seed and the soil and the mm. water, and that mm. makes this big tree. Mm. Of course, Johann Baptiste van Hemholt did conclude that the tree was made entirely of water. Now, while that's not correct, at least he was on the right track, realizing that the matter of a tree doesn't come out of the soil.